because I was in the play Reedy River with, that uh, broke the Amber Australian record for the longest playing show. It played for nearly a year at New Theatre again, played it. Uh, uh, they shifted their premises, and but Reedy River kept on going. And I was in that, but only by virtue of the fact, not so many great acting ability, but by virtue of the fact I'd written the bloody tune, for the, for the, for the title tune for it. And the way I wrote that was that I'd, uh, whenever I was sitting in a train going to school, whenever I uh, ran out of uh, Mozart tunes to hum to myself, uh, I, I'd make up my own tunes and uh, some stage someone, or I, I don't know, someone suggested why don't you try and set some Lawson to music. I, said, <coughs> I was, had a book of Lawson's poetry for a birthday of Christmas or something. So uh, the post-war years or the, the war years um, strongly there uh, and the ideas of um, the Hitler youth and how youth could be corrupted and how social influences affect people. Here was faces in the street that explained why people could be could be uh, become derelicts and um, delinquents and so on. So faces in the street meant a hell of a lot to me when I read it and I tried to set that to music. And I didn't even know about major and minor tunes. And every tune I tried to write for Faces in the Street, it turned out to be in a minor key, and I didn't think it would work. I thought, oh, I can't sing that to anyone. So in desperation, I, uh, sitting in a bus one night, I just flicked this book of Lawson's poems open, it, and there was Reedy River, and I read it, and I thought, ah, oh, that's beautiful, I'll just try that. And uh, in a moment, in, uh, you know, at about four or five minutes, I suppose, maybe less, I had, um, just seemed to fit. Ten miles down Reedy River, a pool of water lies. All the year it mirrors the changes in the skies. Within that pool's broad bosom is room for all the stars It's bed of sand is drifted O'er countless rocky bars And I liked that, it seemed to, you know, express what I wanted to express and I sang it to people and I, I learnt the whole damn poem just by looking at the flaming thing and I sang the whole poem and people said, yeah, yeah, that's, that's not bad, but it's a bit long. And someone said, maybe it needs another tune. So I, Jesus, did I have some trouble writing that second tune? I, I mooched about at, at Eureka Youth League camps for a <clears throat> couple of days, trying to piece together, keeping the feeling of the first tune in my head as a 15, 16-year-old, with games of volleyball all going on around the place and other sports going on and hundreds of people about and here's me mooching about between the games there Think, da -da 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 till I finally got pieced together line by line something that seemed to go with the first tune Beneath the granite ridges, the eye may just discern where rocky creek emerges from deep green banks of fern. Standing tall between them, the drooping shields cool, the hard blue tinted waters before they reach the pool. Ten miles down Reedy River One Sunday afternoon I rode with Mary Campbell To that broad bright lagoon We left our horses grazing Till shadows closed 
climb the peak and stroll beneath the she oaks on the banks of Rocky Creek, then home along the river. That night we rode a race. The moonlight lent a glory to Mary Campbell's face. I pleaded for my future all through that moonlight ride until our weary horses drew closer side by side. Ten miles from Rhymes Crossing, five below the peak, I built a little homestead on the banks of Rocky Creek. Cleared the land and fenced it and plowed the rich red loam. And my first crop was golden when I brought my merry home. And so I'm there. And I, I like the way the beach end worked, but by Jesus, it took me a while to, to work it out. <laughs>